guys welcome back to my channel as you can see I'm currently not wearing any lipstick and it is because I will be doing a review um, and demo of some of my favorite liquid lipsticks that I own um, I don't have a ton but I do have a variety of brands um, and colors most of them are nudish mauve colors but I do have a red um, and a super dark color right here um, so I will explain if I like the formula uh, the color or you know just my thoughts on pretty much everything um, that way you can get a better idea and you can see them and you can determine you know because the market is so big um, there's so many options to see what you like and and the price point and everything if that works for you so if you want to see this review demo just keep on watching Oh, um, and I, I do want to say, just got my roots done, uh, so my hair is really intense right now. Um, and uh, yeah, so stay tuned, I will start the demo right now. Okay, so the first brand that I'm going to talk about is Tarte Cosmetics. And um, this is their lip paint in the color Bestie. I really like the, the applicator um, for this. I don't know if you can see that really like the applicator um, this lip paint is super smooth it doesn't dry out my lips which I really really like this and the Smashbox that I'll show you later um, those are the ones that I always carry in my bag just because they're so comfortable and then if I am eating or you know if, if anything like I can always just take it off and reapply um, it's not too difficult to do that so um, I really like that so I will show you now the application and, and the color so that you can see how, how it wears and how it looks. This is one quote right now. I did have foundation on my lips, so I will go over um, the color one more time so that you can see how it looks. This is how this liquid lipstick looks. Excuse that I didn't wear a I didn't wear a lip liner. I'm not gonna wear any lip liner on any of these so that you can see how it actually wears. So yeah, this is the first color. I really like it. I feel like it goes with any single eye look and every makeup that you have on. It's you know, it's been a while, it has two coats, and it still didn't, it didn't create any lines, like it's still pretty smooth, which I, I really like on a, on a liquid lipstick. This is the only color that I have, unfortunately. I'm gonna have to get some more because it is honestly like so, so comfortable. So now I'm going to remove this lip color and move on to the next one. The next brand that I wanna talk about is Smashbox. And honestly, you'll probably think that all of the colors are super similar. Who knows? Maybe it will look different in the camera. I have no idea. But um, yeah, this is my Smashbox in the color Stepping Out. One of my favorites. I usually always wear this in videos because honestly, I never know what colors to wear for lips. Um, and I always just go to this one because it's just like the safe bet that it's going to look great. Um, so yeah, if you want to see this one, uh, I'll explain a little bit more once I have it on. So this is the applicator. Um, if you can see, like it's like a little triangle. I really like it. It's super easy to apply and get on all the little corners. So this is how stepping out looks. Honestly, I think this is my favorite color. Um, and I really, really like the formula. I, you can't, I mean, it's not dry, you can't see the cracks, it's just like, it looks great and it fits every single makeup look. Also, um, I just really like these types of colors. So I think this one compared to the Tarte is better as far as how it wear, how it feels. It just feels better to me. But uh, this color is awesome, I really, really like it, I like the formula and like I said, this is the one that I probably wear the most out of all of them. 
and it's also easy to remove but it does stay on throughout the day like i said you just have to reapply um but it doesn't look chunky when you reapply you know how some um are so dry that they look really really chunky when you try to reapply or you just don't you just have to remove it and apply later on um there's no problem with this one um it i, I think it's amazing this brand is kat von d and this is in the color lolita super popular color um i think it's one of the ones that i have heard the most uh on youtube videos um and at sephora when i was there i was getting my makeup done because sometimes i'm really lazy and i want to get my makeup done by someone else they recommended this um so i was like sure like let's try it um i bought it and i must say it's the one that lasts the least out of all of them it wears off so quickly i wasn't sure if it was me like why do people love it i visit if it's because of the color yes it's a wonderful color but i feel like there's so much better formulas out there um however i still use it you know it's still one of those like i wouldn't wear it for an event or anything i would just wear it you know to run some errands or to do things every day type of things but i wouldn't wear it to go out just because it doesn't i feel like it doesn't last like if i drink something or if anything like it's not gonna be there for long so i know you probably have seen this already but i will show you how it looks okay so this is the color of the liquid lipstick i did apply um two coats okay the color is stunning like i really like the color like i said it's really comfortable just like the other ones however it doesn't last long that's the only thing for me personally it just doesn't last long so the next brand that i want to talk about is of course kylie cosmetics uh that's the brand that i own more colors of just because i really like them um i love the fact that they come with their lip liners so um i will try them on without the lip liners um, so that you can see, you know, so that everything is fair. Um, but these ones, I'll just pretty much swatch all the colors so that you can see them. And then I'll let you know my thoughts at the very end of the four swatches. Now that you've seen the colors sort of you know how they look on my skin tone and everything this formula is the hardest one to get off just one swipe is enough like the pigment is there they're amazing i really really like them i have really nothing bad to say about them except you know if you're dry maybe moisturize a little bit prior or exfoliate prior because they will because they are so intense they will dry a bit and they will show any imperfections that you have on your lips so just make sure to you know like exfoliate or do something prior so that they look you know amazing um, but that's the only advice that i have on these okay so the next one is i can't even pronounce shiate siate london I have no idea. I'm gonna show you though how it looks. This is the only super dark color that I own. I'll explain if I like it or not, but I'll show you how this color looks. Hopefully I don't make a mess because I still have other colors to review, um, but let's pray. So 
this is how this color looks super dark i know but um i really like how it looks like on certain eye looks like this just looks amazing um i really like it because i don't own anything like this however um it is very streaky you have to try to put a bunch of layers um the good thing is it even if you put a bunch of layers like it doesn't look weird or anything but i mean you will use a lot of product and but honestly i mean it's not like you're gonna wear the, this color every day you might uh it's super comfortable um it takes longer to dry just because i did put so many layers um so it's just a waiting game um it feels comfortable it looks really cool but it is a little bit streaky i think it looks like i just hit myself in the face but it's the color so the last brand that i want to talk about is ofra cosmetics yay this is the most affordable brand that i have in my collection and the formula is great it's comfortable they last long i compare them with the kylie ones and they're just way more affordable i'm gonna show you all three colors just so that you can see how they look um, and i'll let you know more of my thoughts at the end Okay, so this is the last color um, from Ofra, and I mean, I love vibrant colors like this. Um, I do have another red somewhere, but this is um, this is super cute. It has some, it's like orange red mix. Um, it's coming off really orange. But I don't think it looks super orange, does it? Maybe it does. No? It looks red. So on the camera, it's coming off a little bit orange right now on the screen. Maybe it's not, but it looks more red on my camera. Overall, um, my favorite ones are Ofra, Smashbox, and the Kylie uh, lip kits. Um, those are my favorite liquid lipsticks out of all of the ones that I own. If you do want me to review any specific brands, let me know and I can pick up some products from them and try them on for you. But yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you so, so much for watching. Don't forget to like and to subscribe if you haven't already. So yeah, until next time, bye guys.